Hi, so this is my Acer Aspire R5 and I just put an SSD in there and it wouldn't boot up so I wanted to show you what I did to make it boot. And so what I first did was I um, went into the BIOS. So in order to go into the BIOS, when you boot up, you have to press F2, which is what I'm going to do here. I'm going to press F2 very quickly. So I'm going to keep on pressing F2. And you see when I press F2, tapping it. And after I tap it, I'm in the BIOS now. And I'm going to go into the boot screen. Actually, let me zoom in here. So I'm going to go into the boot screen here by arrowing over. And you'll see that right now I have it on my SanDisk SSD. Let me zoom in a little bit more actually for this. So right now I have it on my SanDisk SSD, whereas before it was actually on the hard drive 00, zero the, zero, the um, first hard drive, which isn't there. And I believe that's because it's either an M2 or M3 SSD that you could put there, whereas uh, mine was just a normal SATA SSD. And I put it above the Windows Boot Manager and so it just booted right into the SanDisk, um, which is uh, basically what I prefer. So, but that's really it. That is how I got it to boot after I put in my SSD and it just, it just stalled on the boot screen. Um, but that's really it. Um, and after that, it actually worked. So uh, there you go. That is my tip of the day. And I hope this helped. Um, and if you have any other questions, just send it to me. Uh, once again, this is the Acer Aspire R5. And it's the one with the touch screen. So, but I, I believe other, other Acers work similarly. So um, if you have any questions on those, just uh, you know, give me a shout in the comment area. And I hope this helps. And uh, please subscribe. And thank you for watching.